Are you ever trying to plan your day while also looking at a to-do list? Two's web now has a split view that allows you to look at views and lists side by side to make this easier. In this video, I'll show you how to use the new split view feature. And at the end, I'll teach you a new feature for our drag and drop. First off, big shout out to Larissa O. Oh. She's a designer we've had the pleasure to work with. She did all of the user interviews, found that the split view feature would be very useful for people and did all of the design work to bring this feature to life. So to use a split view, you can just hover your mouse over to the right side of the list and you'll see this add split view button. And if you just click on that, it will open up the split view list picker where you can pick the list that you'd like to open in the split view. Let's open my development list and we'll see that I can now view my day or any list or any view along with my development list in the split view. The other way to open up the split view is by holding down option on Mac or the alt key on Windows and clicking on a list. So maybe we wanted to open up Wednesday, we can just hold option, click. You can do it for the today button if I were to hold down option, click. Same thing with any of the lists in the side menu. If I wanted to open up my dev list again, I can hold down option, click and I'll open up my dev list. And also if you were to be searching, so maybe I wanted to open up my affirmations, I can hold down the option key, click on affirmations, and it will open up that list in the split view. If you wanted to swap the lists, you can use the swap button in the top right, which just will swap these lists. So now affirmations is the main view, and today is the split view, or I can swap them back. And if you wanna change what the split view is, you can just click on this change button, which will bring it back the list picker, where then I can say, I wanna open up my dev list again. Some of the nice features with the split view are that you can drag and drop things between lists. So maybe I was planning on doing the custom onboarding today. I can drag this thing over to my day and it will just be moved onto my day. This is really nice if you were say, looking at the week view. So if we go to side menu, open up week. I can do a similar thing. I have a task list open on the right hand side and I'm just dragging and dropping things to plan out my week. You can also resize the split view just by coming to this bar here, clicking and dragging the view. So you can make the main view or the split view larger or smaller. And it works on any view. I showed it already on the week view, but you can also say one cool view is the universe. You can open up this universe view. Maybe you wanted to look at some of these lists. Maybe I wanted to look at how to play best day ever. You can just hold down option, click on any of these dots, and it will open up that list in the split view. This is just really nice for say, you're just looking at today or planning out today, and you also wanted to have a separate list. Maybe you're taking notes or you're summarizing some notes that you've taken. The split view is very helpful for that. I typically do this with multiple windows. Maybe I'd have my development list open as my main view, and then I'd have my today list open on the side in a separate window, but I can't drag and drop things between these windows. So having it all in one window is really very nice. Now for the drag and drop feature that I mentioned at the start of the video that I wanted to teach you, you can now drag and drop copies of things by while you're dragging something, let's say we wanted to move a copy of this custom onboarding to our dev, we can just hold down command and we'll see that the drop area is now purple. Whereas if you're not holding down command and you're moving it, it'll be blue. But if you're holding down command, the purple signifies that you're moving a copy and when you drop it, you'll move a copy of that thing to that list. So new drag and drop re feature, hold down command or control to move a copy of a thing. When we have cloning things, we'll hook it up to either option or shift but that's to come. The split view will be coming to the desktop app soon. We just wanted to iron out the feature a bit more before making the desktop release. We have a few other improvements we'd like to make, but we'd also like to hear from you. If you have any questions or ideas for improvements, leave them in the comments below. Thank you for watching and have a happy Tuesday.